ain't nothing but a twenty something dollar ride for my baby, my baby. My baby. Ain't nothing but a twenty something dollar ride for my boo. Said it ain't nothing but a twenty something dollar ride for my baby, my lady. And in about twenty something minutes. Hey, this your boy UberX Pro. So somebody just canceled a ride on me. And see what happened? It said receive a fee. So I got I got paid for that right there. So they canceled and I was here under the time frame. I'm gonna do it. So let's see. I can pull up that ride. So Oh, never mind. They're going to the call. They're going to delivery. Okay, good time to show a delivery then, I guess. <laughs> so here we go. So I got it on still. Okay, good, good. Good to move this down a little bit. It's out of the way. All right. So. So we start this delivery up. It's telling me where to go at, which is McDonald's, as usual. Hit my navigation system. I make a couple of these go in right there. So let me see where I gotta go. University. Okay, so on Beach Boulevard. Okay, I know what that's it. Automatically know what that's it. So, so you see how they just basically canceled the ride. I still got paid for it. I had I was in the time frame, and if I and I got the whole amount that I supposed to do when the person cancels the ride, so which was good. So now I'm going on to the next one, which is easy. I'm going to pick up some food, you know, and they give you the person's name, the um, the code number, which sometimes restaurants ask for the code number before they ask for the name. They go by the number. So I click on this little bar right here next to their name, this little bar, and it tells you what the person wants, what they eat, what they eat. So you check the order and stuff like that. And if I get there and they're not ready, I can click that. The less no person that I'm there, but the order's not made yet. So, got that going there. Going up to there. This is easy. This is easy money for me right here. I I do sometimes like picking up food, and then I pay up customers sometimes because I'll be tired. Sometimes I'll be doing this so much, but it's all good though. I got it. I got it under. I got it on there. So, and it's turn by turn. You can use the Uber um GPS, but I do recommend that you use the the um, Waze or Google or something. Whatever you prefer. I like Waze. I always say that. I always like Waze. Waze is awesome to me. I love Waze. Waze is my junk. That's 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 my boy right there. We go we go neck and neck right there. You know, it's like. <laughs> It's like Bobby Brown without Whitney. <laughs> Anyways, I'm silly. But yeah, I like that. So you can use this. For people that's not familiar with your city, I, I, I really recommend that you use your GPS. The GPS is on your phone, not the Uber GPS. Because right, well, what you don't see, for an example, is you don't see the traffic. You know, you don't see the restaurants and the like. You can zoom in. You might every once in a while get a restaurant going on right here. It's on today. It's doing good today. But what I like using is the Waze app. So I'm going to show you the big difference on these two apps, right? <laughs> so look, this is giving me turn by turn, right? I can hit this button and get options on where I need to go at, which they only got one because it's not that far. So... You know, you can get this, you can zoom in, you can zoom out, you can see traffic around you, what's going on, you can see all the different logos and stuff, helps you out more better. It's a better picture than what you got on Uber. But you can use that though. Only reason I'm using it because I know my area and I'm talking to y'all and I want you to see what I'm doing so you can get an idea or make it easy for you to, you know what I'm saying, to get your order out right. So I'm almost there. And usually, I like going through the drive through I don't like grabbing all that stuff. And on top of that, they try to give you that that paper, that like that little um, box cup holder. That is not a good cup holder to have. I always get the styrofoam one. 
because it's stable. I can sit on the floor and I can, and it won't rock. It won't, you know what I'm saying? It won't flip over because I don't have a bag. You, I mean, Uber don't really give us a bag. We can buy a bag from Uber, but I really don't. I don't really get a bag. I can, or you can just get one off a bag, uh, Amazon, a, a food bag, or something like that. But technically, in here, we don't have to have a bag. And I always tell the people that when I go in these places, please make sure that you put on, put on what you call it, put on a sticker on there, because sometimes customers think you be in their food, but I don't be in their food and stuff like that. Anything to basically make your job harder. You know, they people seal the stuff up. If the stuff is sealed up, then that's good. And I don't check no bag. I just tell people to cuss, tell people to make sure, you know, that the food, the order is right in the bag. Cause, I mean, I, sometimes I go back and grab the food from, but it, it wastes my time because I'm not getting really paid for that. I'm just being nice. You know, you have to call another Uber and order something out, or let this uh, restaurant know, hey, this messed up. I'm going to flip my camera around. I'm going to go inside this time and show you how this junk works. I'm going to go in there. So. All right. So I'm pulling up to McDonald's. It's telling me I'm arriving. So I get a good parking spot. Here we go. I'm going to show you how this go. Pull up. I'm on my car. I'm gonna change the camera app on. It's this thing. It's pretty pretty cool. Put this around. It's gonna let me. Okay. Flip the camera around. Go we'll walk in here real quick. <laughs> Yes. It's not ready yet? Yes. Can I get that styrofoam on um, cup holder, please? The styrofoam cup holder. All right, start making that video possible. What's Hey, wait. Hold on. Thank you. Who birthday today? My birthday was mom the ninth, February. Aquarius is on. <laughs> Yeah, I put them on the side right there. Have a good one, alright? Alright. So, I got the order. This is how I set my order up. Like this, a styrofoam cup. Open this door. Alright, I'm going to go 
back to the camera real quick. That's how I set it up right there like that. So, once I get the order, I check the order. So, it wasn't bad. I slide this over and begin the trip. Just let me know where to go at, you know. Okay, since I'm not too familiar with that street set, I'm gonna put my Waze app on. Set my food on the floor so I won't get damaged. Go like that. All right. So I'm gonna hit. Let me make sure this thing is going. Okay, it's still recording. Okay, I'm gonna make sure I'm gonna go like this. Start the trip up. Matter of fact. Up. 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 Stuck. Sorry about that. Okay. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop the video right here, but um, this is how you do that stuff. Um, this is your boy UberX Pro. I'm gonna go handle this money real quick. I hit y'all back up. Um, make sure you subscribe on my page. Um, if you need any help, just let me know. Y'all have a um, blessed day. Thank you. Okay, I'm back on this order I was just doing. Um, so I get to the spot, right? And the address is like in the middle of the road, which doesn't make any sense. So what I want to do is basically, and this is how I start my timer off. I will hit this, I'll hit the contacts number. I already called the person like other a couple of times and they answer the phone, so I'm gonna call them like that. Hang it up. And what's gonna happen is it pops up up top of that. Change the whole thing. It pops up. So even though I didn't call this person a couple of times, so I'm just showing y'all how it works. Once you hang up that phone and you're in that, as long as you're in that spot. You hit that up there in the um right there up under the phone in the right hand corner up there. Cannot reach. Go there. Sends. And it counts down. So that countdown basically lets the in the, lets the um the um person that ordered the food let them know that hey I called you and you didn't answer the phone and you have an eight minute window right there. If you don't contact me in that time frame. I get to cancel this order, get paid for it, and keep your food or throw it away. How do I want to do with it? So I'm going to wait. You know, I'm going to let them know to call me back so I can find the address because usually this happens, especially in apartment complexes happen, apartment complex because they put the address but don't put the apartment number or how to get contact. So if you do that, they're going to call you back. They should, they should call me back. I'm going to wait for them to call me back. Because the address is off. I'm in the spot. As you can see, I'm in the pinpoint spot where I'm supposed to be at. I'm right where I'm supposed to be at. You know, this is how it works, you know. I have to wait on the person. So I'm now sitting here just waiting to see if they're going to call me back. If they don't call me back in the time frame, like I said, I get to throw the food away, keep the food, which I'm not really going to eat because I'm a keto. I'm not really careful for this food. I give it to a homeless person, let them eat it or something, you know, or get, take it back home to my kids or you know, something like that. But I wait to see people going to call me, see how much they contact me. And it shows you a lot how people don't, you know what I'm saying, look at their phone and stuff like that. Like, for instance, I had one call. It was like $40. It was from IHOP. Whole big breakfast order. Big breakfast order. Oh, they hit me up. So they hit me up in the apartment complex. But they had a big breakfast order. You know, I knocked on the door and everything. It was at night. They answer, I waited like an hour and something, which I wasn't supposed to wait an hour. I waited to be nice. So I canceled the order, got paid for it, and took it home to my kids and let them eat it. Strawberry pancakes to work, all that good stuff, you know. So they put the apartment number. So it's 808. Cause I didn't know if they, and still don't really know because the address is wrong. It doesn't match up with the apartment complex that I'm in. And I don't think these numbers go that far. But I'm for to find out though. I'm looking for 
for this little one. And, this, and, it's still, and even though I left this spot, the pinpoint spot, it is still counting down. Letting them know that, hey, you know, I'm reaching. A lot of you, you be surprised the customers that I get that don't answer that phone call when they're supposed to. And I throw away their food or, you know, give it to somebody or something. Like I said, I don't really eat, so I don't care for the food anyways. So, excuse me. Go around and cut around here. Ooh, that's sun bright. Okay, I see the numbers coming up now. And the customer's waving her hand at me, so she got it. So, right here. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna flip this like this so y'all can see me up there <sighs> we got car real quick how you doing now freezing Order. I always put it on the floor like, like this. Just easy to carry it like that. Oh, thank you so much. You're welcome. Here we go. Thank you. All right, you have a good one, all right? All right. So I got done with that ride right there. So once you deliver the order, swipe it over. I got another one at McDonald's again on Emerson. Different, different McDonald's. Left the door open. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, this one right here kind of off. He kind of kind of ghetto here sometimes. Kind of trips me out. And I go here. Uh, okay, we got so many McDonald's in the area, of Jacksonville, Florida. That's why I'm at. We got so many McDonald's around. So many McDonald's. You know. This app is pretty cool. So y'all see me. Y'all see me. But that'll show you how I did that order. You know, I'm not gonna make this video long. I just want to get to the basics detail. I like to get to the nitty gritty and let people know how this how this job go, you know. It's what can I say? Only real way you can make money off of this if you run all the apps together. Lyft, Uber, Uber Eats, whatever's in your whatever's in your city that you have, use all the tools that these ride shares give you for you to make your money. Point blank. Very blank. Because if you don't use the tools that you get, <laughs> he won't make the money. He will not make the money. <laughs> I seen a lot of people on YouTube got the page. I seen this one girl. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna say nobody's name, but um, she was on there first time. You know, just started up. She had option to do UberX and um. And Uber Eats, she had the, the platform for it. She just was doing, she was just doing Uber Eats. And it depends on what city it is and how hype it is, how your money's gonna go. Uber Eats in Jacksonville has been around for a minute. At first it was kind of slow, 
but then it grow because we got so many restaurants in Jacksonville, like so many. Better the town center, it be it just be booming. So I get a lot of calls. I can I can actually turn my app. I'm gonna get a lot of calls, but I'm not gonna get as much money as as I get like doing all the apps together, you know. So, but for Uber Eats, it's easy for me to do. It's like easier than picking up people, but. I wouldn't do it just like all day without using the other apps. I have to use them. I gotta, I gotta, I have a quarter I gotta make. I try to make $200 a day. That's me. Point blank. You know, everybody can't do me. You know, everybody can't do me. I mean, I can give you tips, but you have to get your own groove. I just point you in the right direction where you can make your own money. You know what I'm saying? That like to be in my camera. So. I'm almost there. But yeah, I think I'm gonna let y'all go because I got, I got a lot of stuff I gotta do. I gotta focus on this money. I'm gonna, if I got any other thing, I'll just record it. Um, just wanted to show y'all some stuff, how this thing go. I'm gonna put more videos on there. Mm. Let me know if you wanna see more, longer videos like this and see what I'm doing on a daily basis. You know, some customers will let me actually record them. So I asked them people that. Like I just took a girl with a asker kai, add a picture on to my YouTube page. You're gonna probably see it probably over over there on the on the right hand side of me. You know, I see these. So I'm gonna keep on driving up here. But this your boy UberX Pro. You know what I'm saying? Anything you need to know, let me know. And I'm here for you. You know what I'm saying? Just to give you heads up, I'm the man. You know, y'all have a blessed day. And um, Uber and Lyft on, all right? My baby, My baby. ain't nothing but a 20 cent dollar ride for my boo.